everybody out there in YouTube world. Check out this next video we're putting on here. It's going to be about campgrounds. We're going to stay uh, in Walmarts, Cracker Barrels, anywhere we can stay for free. And we're going to pay big money for good places. But we're going to show you all of them. So you make a judgment for yourself. So follow my channels by subscribing. Give me a thumbs up and leave a comment on what you thought of the campground. Thank you. These are some campsites along the west side of Lake Cascade. Across the view there is where we are staying. So check these out. Well, that's the point I walk to every day. This is from the other side of the lake where there's a bunch of campgrounds that I'm going to show you about right now. They're only $5, but they look like they're all booked. But you can see, uh, you walk to the point there and we're camped way back in that way. And that's where the point is. Beautiful, beautiful places to camp here. And cheap, but they're all dry camping. But I like this right here. You got a beach, but I don't know about Hank and that water. It just scares me. Well, there's the boat dock I think we went to uh, the other day. Let's see if we can find it with the zoom. Nope, that's somebody else's boat dock. It's a big lake. Big lake. We're going to go do some more exploring, but I wanted to show you these little campsites. It's been pretty cool here with the beach and all, as long as the water's safe. Uh, what was the name of this camp, this one? Huckleberry. Huckleberry Campground. Uh, we've seen four of these little campgrounds. They're state-owned by the Idaho. So that's that. <laughs> okay, we're at a campground, and we're not going to get her in the picture. But uh, we got you got to go to Reserve America. America.com for, and then put in Idaho and all that. Just ca Lake Cascade. Lake Cascade. I got that zoomed. Lake Cascade, and you can find all these places. I was definitely wrong about the price. Uh, there are different prices. They're five dollars just to get in, unless you have the, yeah. unless you have the card. Uh, and then it's different prices for different ones. This one right here we're at is called Huckleberry. Huckleberry, and it's fifteen dollars a night. But look at the view you get. So uh, they're all there, depending on how many hookups. But go on that, that site and check it out if you want to stay up here. Right now she said they're empty and she doesn't never seen it this way, but in a few days it won't be because it's Labor Day weekend. Mm -hmm. And then they'll be packed. Yep. And she's marking it right here, right now, I guess. Yeah. Putting on the ones that you can't be here no more. <laughs> <laughs> it's reserved. So check it out, guys. Thanks for your help, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Five dollars a night for dry camping. This is the area. We noticed most everything was reserved. So uh, you might want to get on the old internet and find out more about that. But you got a hell of a nice view over there from that lake. If you get one on that lake side. Interesting. Uh, very big sites and definitely dry camping. Well, there's a water hose out there. You might be able to get water and take it over to your RV. But uh, there's quite a few of these little campgrounds alongside here over uh, on the road towards Tamarack. There we go. Oh, they got a dump site. That's not bad. As I stated earlier in the video, there's quite a few of these campsites down through here. So go to that link, 
that the lady told you about and uh, reserve a campsite for yourself. Probably got to do it quite a ways in advance. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you.